In this video segment, I'd like to demonstrate how to use Word 2003's Track Changes feature to assist in collaborating to edit a document. I want to turn on the Reviewing Toolbar by clicking, right-clicking in the Toolbar area and come down and select Reviewing. We've seen this toolbar before when we inserted a comment. This time, I want to click the uh, Track Changes button, which is right here that says Track Changes. Alternatively, I could come up to Tools and Track Changes, and that would do the same thing as would Control shift e But this time, I want to use the Track Changes. Now you can see that the comments that I made in the previous video now show up. If I come here and I delete a comment, and I'm going to go ahead and delete the other comment, I can choose delete all comments even. With the track changes button turned on, I could change one of these, the non-germinating. Suppose I wanted to take that into account and change that to sprouting. And by changing that to sprouting, it has st stricken the word non-germinating and inserted the word sprouting. But in the, on the toolbar, it tells me I'm looking at my original showing the markup. If I would like to do the final showing the markup, it shows the word sprouting in and shows what was deleted. I could also show just the final or just the original. But in this case, I would like to show the final with the markup. If I want to change another term, let's say the word respirometer. I'm going to go in and do a find and replace. And I'm going to change respirometer. And I'm going to replace that with respiration, respiration device and do replace all, it will show every place that has been changed. It also puts a little mark in the left margin or selection bar showing every place that a change has been made. And if I want to keep these changes, I save my document and exit the program.